Hello, welcome back. Yay. We're... No, I'm actually really happy about this because we finally passed what I call the deja vu arc. <laughs> now we're actually moving on with the game. Anyway, <laughs> I, decided to sh I decided to show this because, well, as you play the game, it actually does tell you, like, uh, uh, the progress that you've done. Yeah. I also to show you what happens if you actually do go back to one of the planet chunks. That fucking mouth movement. <laughs> Also decided to show this because uh Mrs. Dialogue. What are you playing at? Mom needs the mushroom. You need grub tubs. <laughs> that's the worst that's the one thing about this. I decided to go back to, uh went back to my other profile to kind of show off a couple of things. For example, we we talked about how if you actually uh also this. <laughs> It's good, sir. Please move, sir. Sir, okay, I'll, I'll move my own way. We talked about how if uh, we run out, they'll run back in, and well, they do. Oh, that's interesting. Oh shit, do furry. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, or in my case, I like to think it's like uh, a student like watching out for a teacher, and as soon as a teacher comes in, it's like, oh shit, do teacher. And there he goes again. Miss Finster is coming after us. Run. Also, this is- I also wanted to show off, like, what would happen if the bar actually did, uh... Oh god, it's gonna be depressing, isn't it? You'll see. Also, I noticed- I just re I realized something while I'm doing this. Look at that. Whoa. There's a- there's a completely different trail. Huh. I'll show that off after this. Now watch what happens. Absolutely nothing! What the fuck? <laughs> it just- it just takes you back, because... It could show up anything depressing. Now, here's the alternate route I never knew of until I replayed it. There's nothing really new to it. It's just something I decided to show show because I never actually knew this. I always took the left route. Literally nothing new, just a different route. Huh. Grant, I, I took the left route because Tricky like is running there, but it's like, what's the, I got to get the point. I guess there's really no point to the other route. It's just if you want to take it. Huh. Fascinating. A, it's a bit long. It, honestly, it's a bit longer, so there's really no point, but I decided just to show that off. Hmm. But yeah, that's like really lazy. You think there'd be at least a little bit of a cutscene, but no, they just fade to black and that's it. It's like the ending to The Sopranos. Also, um, I didn't show it there, but for some reason the game glitched. Oh, wait, first this. Look at my puppet mouth, Fox! My hat is jumping off of my head. It's trying to escape, but it never will. Makes me think of the uh, the one hat from Mario Party 8. The hat that moves with the freaking announcer. I never you ever played Mario? You play oh, you ever, you ever played Mario Party 8? No, I haven't, actually. Actually, yeah, yeah I did, actually. Oh, also, I show this off. I died, but I freaking just... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Also, I love the timing because freaking Peffy's like, keep going. Oh, I'm going forward, Peffy. So, right to that mountain. So forward, I'm dead. Uh, but uh, no, in the snowhorn part, uh, the game glitched. And for some reason, uh, even when I made it to the safe point, the bar kept going down. So as soon as I got off the snowhorn, it reverted back. But I was still in the, in the same area. Like if you were to go into the blizzard. That's weird. Like, I, yeah, it was weird. Anyway, now we're back at Dinosaur Planet, and also, we seem to have a, uh, welcoming party. You got to help us. Oh god, a female. That's, that's female? Yes. It sounds like either Merry or Pippin okay, from okay, Lord of the Rings. I'll see what I can do. Also, you guys are wimps. Don't forget about the phone. Hey, look, if, Peppy, your uh, head's a bit, uh, flickering. <laughs> either it's a hologram or it isn't. Make up your mind. I don't know. You want to play, so let's play. No! <laughs> it's a waste of fucking time! Peppy here? I need help. Yourself stuck again? The beacons won't burn by themselves! Oh my god. What were the Thorntails saying about fireweeds? Oh, oh, I can't help you. I'm shutting your fuck up now. No. Okay, so basically, uh, they're afraid of the dark. Please also, I'm gonna talk to every things. single Thorntail. It's so dark at night. I get real scared. Wimp. There's only three beacons. It's not like it can completely cover the entire area. 
Like, the shit, sharp claw every thorn tail sounds like either Merry or Pippin from Lord of the Rings. And here's the... Oh, wait. Have you seen our fireweed tree yet? Jose. It's 420 all the time. Yeah. Jose, they're taking the thorn tails to Isengard. <laughs> no, the thing that, um... Like, that's really funny, though. Out of all the things the thorn ta the Not the thorn tails. The uh, sharp claw could have done... They extinguished the flames. They could have beaten up the queen again. They could have kidnapped every single one of these thorn tails. Hell, they could have even beat. They could have even blew off the freaking uh, warp stone for all we care. But nope, they just decided to blow out all three beacons because it's it's less work. Hey, it's for the lols. You're all, you're all getting the fireweeds. I like it. No, it's like um. They only start... Uh, I never noticed them on fire before, right? Like, this is the only time they ever go on fire. As far as I can tell. Like, I've always passed that tree. Never once was it on fire. But the moment we need it, they're going blazing. Also, this fucker. Hey, he's a very depressed individual. Don't judge him. No kidding. He has a freaking uh, bat uh, flying above him. Do you think that bat just comes down to fuck with him a bit? <laughs> Probably. Hey, motherfucker! So basically, you had to take the fireweeds, which for some reason they're on fire to begin with. Mm -hmm. And I fall. But luckily, Tricky still saves the day. Mm -hmm. But yeah, you had to take the fireweeds. For some reason, again, they're on fire. And you had to light up all the beacons. Now, there's three beacons. There's one right there, one next to the, th the warp stone. But then there's one I... It took me a while to actually find. At least when I first played it, because... Yeah, it's in an area you need to unlock. And the game really gives you no indication of this. So explore! Basically, it's just like, that's like the one area... You are you don't even go there because uh, that's the... Um, you go to that place later, but like right now you wouldn't know about it unless you actually did look around a bit. Yeah, like... So at least when you're first playing, it's kind of like, uh, where do I go, where do I go, where do I go? By the way, that spellstone icon will always be up there until you get rid of it, just so that the game reminds you, yes, you have a spellstone. Same goes for Grizoa Spirits. I think we actually saw, we, we saw that freak uh, when we played as Crystal. Yeah, but I didn't point it out then, so. Oh, pl oh, like that matters. Well, I like pointing things out, you know. Also, That's something I uh, I just remembered uh, in the lower in the left hand corner, you can see like uh, scanning for information. If you move the, D the that's where the map is. If you move the D-pad, you have a couple of uh, selections. You either have the map, not really used, not really needed, but you know. Says the guy the... who bought all the maps. Yeah, no, but whatever. You have the uh, scanning for information, where if you literally go to anything with health or anything with an indication, it will literally just spout random information. And then you have this thing, which um, locates fuel cells. Yes, it's right behind this here uh, gate, which I'm not going to go through right away, because mm -hmm. I'm, uh, trying to, because I, uh, that's before I realized, oh, that's right, it's over there. <laughs> oh, good. Also, I, well, wait, damn, oh, I thought that was, like, gonna, I thought it was gonna go right next to the, uh, our wing. But yeah, the fuel cell compass I find to be useless, because they're so easy to find to be. Oh, here we go. Oh, wait, damn it. Oh, never mind, go ahead. Damn. Uh, I was just saying that the fuel cell compass is useless. It, it really is. Well, sometimes. At least, like, in the, um... Especially, like, in the later game, where... You really don't... We By the time you actually get the uh, fuel cells, you're not gonna really uh, need the compass anymore. Yeah. Because the game... Because without even going to the uh, Thorntail shop... Will we, ever relight the beacons? we got it under control, buddy. Calm down. But by the time we get to the, uh, like, end game, the game will, uh, even without going to the, uh, Thorntail shop, you're not gonna need, uh, even go- uh, I'm freaking losing my mind, God damn it! Basically, uh, if you just collect every fuel cell you'll you, you so um, see, like, in, in a general area, like you'll most likely have enough, like, all you'll need for the entire game. Yep. They're really not that difficult to find. The game doesn't really make much of an attempt to hide them very well, so. There's at least a couple that they that are hidden really well. 
But again, by the time you actually even notice them, you'll already you'll already have all you need. Pretty much. Also, they gave Did us you the just moon hit pass. Tricky? Uh, no. You just hit Tricky. I don't know what you're talking about. You just hit Tricky. You. Just you are. Don't even talk to me about that. You are just as much guilty. <laughs> yeah, but you judged me for that. I know. But, but then you turn around and do it like, oh, and I'm innocent because I'm Jose. <laughs> because all mine are accidents. Take care of my son, Buck. We got it. Well, uh, <laughs> I say that as I actually whacked him. The volcano lies beyond Moon Mountain Pass. Oh boy, Moon Mountain Pass, an area that has fucking nothing. The sacred flames mean so much to us. They're really sacred. Of the, oh, well, actually, yeah, the prince does uh, lit the flames, I guess. It is sacred. It's sacred. But off, again, of all thi No, wait, wait a minute. I have a question. Thank you, Hold on. I have a question. If Tricky you, kisses Tricky. on a rock... Is the rock now sacred? <laughs> Look in uh, the area no. Of the ancient but well, he burned the torches and now they're apparently sacred. There. At least the, no, the flames are sacred. Yeah, the flames are sacred. But I'm saying, if Tricky pisses on a rock, is the piss sacred? Is the rock sacred? Or we're not going. We're not having this conversation. Also, here we go. The R wing has seen better days. <laughs> no kidding. Yeah. It was much shinier before. The Great Fox was shinier before. Now it just looks like it's barely holding itself together. Admittedly, it looks pretty cool the in the salt. Returned, the tribe is saved. You guys are a bunch of wimps. <laughs> but no, no, it's just like, um... The flames are holding itself together. Yeah. You know... Uh, we, you know, we used the fire weed, but, you know, Tricky blew up the fire. And this play, this pass sucks. Oh, Those yeah. rooms are bullshit. Yeah, you can't get through a lot of these areas without getting hit by at least one shroom. No, the fact is that uh, th in the uh, next area, do you have a chance of, uh, f of um, having to start all over? Like, uh, black screen, redo everything? Yeah. I think I'll probably. I think I'll. Uh, I think I'll probably show. No, here's. No, I'll show it off here. But anyway, what I was saying about the torches, we used the fireweed. You know, tricky. Uh, blew it on with fire. It's now it's uh, all light. Now how the heck is it gonna keep being on fire? Because it's sacred. <sighs> and again, I freaking love how that works. <laughs> Forget the sharp are stupid. Also, I fail. Oh, you fucking idiot! No, here's no. Here's why this place is bullshit. As soon as you spawn right back in, you're next to a mushroom! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Those fucking mushrooms are so stupid! And I'm actually kind of glad I died, because as soon as I blow this, uh, this door up again, I remember about going to find the, uh, cheat tokens. Oh, right. oh. Yeah. yeah, right there. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. So but no, this area, this whole- The mushrooms are so stupid. They are, like, I just hate these mushrooms in general. They are worthless, and they only serve to really inconvenience you. Oh, no, they get, those, those, that, those two mushrooms right in the beginning get particularly bullshit in later, uh, in the later game. So we're going after cheat tokens now? Yep. Oh, but because this is so worth our fucking time. Oh, you already got a to what, where'd you get the token again? That was the first cheat token you get from a thorn t the Thorntail shop. Ah, okay. But no, before we, we're not gonna go directly to the maze right away. We're actually we're gonna be going to Ice Mountain. Ah, right, because we still have both um, Ice Mountain and Snowhorn Wastes. Yep, it's waste, not wastes. It, I thought, Are you ready? I, but it was oh, pronounced. Oh. I I thought it was pronounced wastes. Like I thought that sounds like a fr that sounds like a that sounds like a food product. I swear the characters pronounced it wastes. Did I just imagine <laughs> that? I just... You're fine. <laughs> the way you say it, wastes, it sounds like you're a kid saying racist. <laughs> no, I swear the characters <laughs> pronounce it that way. Someone pull up a clip that has them pronouncing it wasted. I know it sounds stupid, but the characters <laughs> pronounce it that <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. 
Shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> what is this? It's pretty- I'm pulling up the clip right now in the middle of this playthrough. <laughs> oh, my stomach. <laughs> Either it sounds like a kid saying racist, or it sounds like some kind of, like, food grain product or whatever. It's, oh. They pronounced it wasted. I swear, <laughs> I'm not going crazy here. Also, I decided to do this again because I I thought uh you can get pe you can um uh, race back down there and you know and start and go back to the same area you were when you first found Tricky. Also, I wanted to race them again because I wanted to do the uh, brake check method. You see, he ran in front of me. That was not my fault. Also, brake check all the way. I'm still trying to find the clip. Oh my god! D freaking forget about it! Just watch the dang video! Oh my god, are you still- Oh my god, they just forget about it. it! They pronounced it Wastus! I am not crazy, they pronounced it Wastus! <laughs> Whatever you say, Wastest. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> it's how it's pronounced, you fuck! <laughs> I'm getting back to the freaking video, Christ. Also, this is where I. This thing right now, I lose the race because of that. Are you even paying attention? Or are you still freaking on the thing? No, I'm paying attention now, but. It's oh, just... now Also, I lose because of that. Forget. You suck at driving. Oh, like you have any right to talk. Okay. Also, this, this is interesting. This is the first time I actually learned about this. Happy Sharp Claw. Freaking mocking bastard. Happy Sharp Claw is happy. I'm also pissed. <laughs> Stop hitting the air at nothing, you stupid shit. Also, we do it again, but I'm gonna skip a, a majority of the race. As soon as we get past the, uh... As soon as I kill both of these Sharp Claws. But no, that's actually the... Have you actually went back to Ice Mountain before? Like, after you beat, you're beating and whatnot. You see, now here is where I do better. Break check method, because they're stupid. Oh, that's satisfying. Indeed it is. And also just a nice, smooth ride. I like how you all see the, uh, the snow runs on the sides. Now, this is funny. Yeah. It's a freak, it's just like, now, uh, there's also where I get pissed off. <laughs> what, did you think the thing would bring you to Snow Horn? Yes! That's the whole reason I did it! <laughs> you are an idiot! How would you bite me? Anyway, I like how that, wor play play that works. Also, big, big furry and friendly. Hmm. That is what describes a Snow Horn, except the one you first meet, in which case, He's a, just a beggar. I'm too hungry to talk to strangers. Also, you just have to go into Tay after oh. you, uh... Oh, how I long to see her again. I'm pretty sure uh, our first conversation, you didn't want anything to do with her. At least I think so. Well, he did say stuff like, My daughter dishonored me. To me, that's, that basically sounds the same as, I, I don't want anything to do with her. Also... I, I finally, we can finally learn about this thing's name. The Snaplock. Snaplock? What the fuck is a Snaplock? The Snap, the Snaplock. Snaplock, whatever. We can, can pop out anywhere, so at least we know its name and you have to refer to it as that stupid name you gave it. What, the living dildo or something? Yes! <laughs> I'm still gonna call it that. Because Snaplock, oh God. because Snaplock just sounds stupid. You, you're stupid. But no, uh, on the, uh, on the freaking uh, Ice Mountain race, I like how both Fox and the Sharp Claw, as soon as they finish the race, there's no beating each other, there's no punching in the face, no death, it's like a freaking friendly rivalry, it's not like we're at, we're at odds, guys. <laughs> Maybe the Sharp Claw just said, that particular Sharp Claw just said, fuck it. Also, <clears throat> also, if you look in that cave, as soon as I destroy this box, it's in my way. I think I briefly saw it. There's a sharp claw. Yeah, in there. sharp claws are still in there. 
but they won't they won't come out because you're not doing the whole garande thing. <laughs> exactly. It's. I guess they probably forgot about them. Either that or those sharp claws are hiding. We don't want to piss off the snow horn. Or like they just don't want to freaking face us. Uh, scales. What are the what are those are the ones that actually ran away? Hmm. As soon as freaking Garunate breaks out of the ice, he th 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 you see like two sharp claw running away. Yeah. Maybe I wonder they if they are. just went back. They probably just went back in there. Yeah, maybe. Either because it's too cold, or they're just too afraid to leave that cave. Mm -hmm. Like a cat and a like a cat, like a mouse, in, like a a cat hounding over a mouse hole. Mm -hmm. And now we go to the game whale maze. Oh goody, we're showing this off. Just once. Yes, go into the ass, go into the crotch area or ass area or something of the warp stone. Well, if it's a hole, then obviously it must be a. Uh... We're basically in his innards. Ovaries, yes. <laughs> God, that sounds wrong. God damn it, you're disgusting. <laughs> you're the one who said it. <laughs> you're the one that started it. <laughs> but you said ovaries. <laughs> because of you. Bullshit. It's your fault. Bullshit. I didn't do anything. Also, if you notice, I had 25 scarabs, picked up a red, it's 10. But. <clears throat> I also. Also, uh, but the thing is, later on, you also you I also pick up a couple of other red scarabs. Mm -hmm. There, I think it varies. Some are worth ten, and then there are some that are worth only five. That's weird. Maybe there are different shades. Apparently, they, they were they just couldn't they just couldn't change the color at least one little thing. For God's sake, you gotta turn the ten ones to gold. Yeah, that that probably would have made it things better and everything and all that shit. And oh God, this maze is dull. <laughs> Well, you have those things. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I don't show it. I do actually do scan them. Or at least try to. Mm -hmm. They don't have a name. They're just living uh, plants trying to punch you in the face. Wow, they're dickheads. I do not go... You could exit I do not go in there. Yeah, you could potentially exit the maze from there. But if you're looking for the cheat well, that ain't gonna help you so much. <laughs> I do lose my way a couple times because, dear God. God, I feel like I'm at the. Have you? I, what do you? What do you think about the maze area? Other than, do you think it's just pointless? It's kind of pointless because it's just kind of. There it is. I feel like it's adding a lot of shit to, like to to cheats and stuff, and it should be very. And I I'm a person who thinks cheats should be rather simple, but. Cheat activated. The thing is, as soon as you put the, the tokens in there, they, it says cheat activated, but it doesn't tell you the cheat. Yeah. You have, to, you have to look it up yourself. Yeah, look it up at the menu. Like, one of them can get can change. The, the first one is probably the most stupidest. And also, I love this one. R pay attention to this. Well looks into your future. His life force is strong. His existence is like a virus. I can hear his breath every corner of space. He will not only use the evil heart of others, but can also corrupt those that are good. Are, are they talking about who I think they're talking about? Uh, I believe so. Uh, and if so, I'm not sure how I feel about that. Like, they're talking about Andrew. I think, are, are they talking- Stop. Oh, doesn't even matter at this point. <laughs> yeah, uh, I mean, I'm not spoiling anything. Andros is a villain of the Star Fox games. I mean, if anything, you overreacting is a spoiler. You're a spoiler. Your mom's a spoiler. Okay, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Man, aren't you just... <laughs> oh yeah, just also punishment. What? You're not gonna throw it, are you? Oh no! Am I? You prick! All right. So we're gonna be. So me and Elder are gonna be watching this ball. We'll cut off. We'll cut up to when he turns color. 